This training video is provided by Ferro Fence and Gate Supply Inc. In this video, we will cover the installation of fence panels. For this project, we will need the following tools. A string line, line level, torpedo level, a drill extension, and caulk gun. A post hole digger, shovel, two foot level, cordless drill, and sawzall and a wheelbarrow for mixing cement. You will also need one 40-pound bag of quick-setting cement for each fence post you will be installing. Installation begins with stretching a string line the length of the fence run. Next, measure and mark the location of each fence post. Fence posts should be placed 94.5 inches apart as measured from the inside of one fence post to the inside of the next, or 96.5 on center. Dig post holes for each fence post approximately 9 inches in diameter and 18 to 20 inches deep. When preparing to set fence posts, begin by mixing a batch of cement in the wheelbarrow. Empty a bag into the wheelbarrow and have an assistant add water slowly while mixing the cement. Be careful to mix the cement thoroughly and add water in small amounts until the mix reaches a consistency that stacks when turned over with a shovel. Place a fence post into post hole and check for plumb on two adjacent sides. Once the fence post is straight, add cement to the post hole being careful to avoid getting a cement onto the pole above the ground line. Fill the hole until cement is 2 to 3 inches below ground level. This will allow for filling the remaining space with dirt and growing grass all around the post base. Measure 94.5 inches from the inside side of this post to locate the inside side of the next fence post. Repeat this process for all fence posts. Allow cement to cure for 24 hours before proceeding. Note that the tops of the fence posts may not all be the same height. These will be trimmed to size later in this process. Insert mounting brackets into both ends of the top and bottom rails of the fence panel. Holding the fence panel in place and ensuring the top rail of the panel is level, Drive the included self-tapping screws through the panel insert mounting bracket and into the fence post on all four corners of the panel. Measure the distance between two fence posts. If the distance between fence posts is less than 94 and a half inches, subtract one half inch from the measurement for the panel mounting inserts and transfer this measurement to the fence panel. Using the reciprocating saw, carefully cut the top and bottom rails of the fence panel. Install the cut panel using the same procedures as before. To complete the fence, measure and mark each post one inch above the top rail. Using the sawzall, carefully cut the post at this mark. Repeat this procedure for each post. The post cap snaps into place on top of each post. No adhesive or fasteners are required. This completes the install of the post and panels for the Ferro Fence and Gate Supply Fence Systems.